<laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to our monthly team call. Thank y'all for joining us. Uh, my name is Raya Moore, and I'm a Diamond Ambassador with Plexus, and I love telling my story, and I love hearing other people's stories, too. So we are um, in the thick of August, middle of August, y'all. And you may notice a theme on our team uh, this month, and that's really, you know, casting vision, sharing our stories, um, really uh, focusing on our why, where we were before we got here, where we are now, and where we are going, right? Um, and we, we, we love to know who we are and whose we are, right? And if you don't know where you're going, y'all, then you're just going to be stuck, right? So um, I wanted to do this call today and really share um, some stories for our, from our GRIT team leaders. And so I'm excited today. You'll be hearing from Adrienne Williams, Bertina Bennett, and Nikki Swain. They'll be telling you their stories. So without further ado, I will pass it on along. And I believe, um, who is, is uh, Bertina, you're starting us off, right? Yes. Okay. So I will mute myself and hush. I've got to tell somebody, I just can't keep it to myself, oh, God is good to me, and i got to tell somebody, I just can't keep it to myself, oh, what Plex is doing for me, good evening, good evening, good evening. My name is Bertina Bennett, and I'm a senior gold ambassador with Plexus Worldwide. Plexus was introduced to me to my life at a time where I needed it the most. I just retired after 33 years in higher education. The last 12 years I spent at Texas Southern University as the assistant vice president for student services. Y'all, it was a fun exciting and rewarding career. I wouldn't change it for nothing in the world. But I was so busy being of service to others, but I neglected to be of service to myself. COVID came and it forced me to look at me. I had to do a complete overhaul, mind, body, and spirit. And when I decided to choose me, after 93 years of age and service and teacher retirement, I was introduced to Plexus. And I joined Plexus to lose weight. This weight, y'all, has been a lifelong battle for me. I was on Weight Watchers in elementary school. I mean, just up and down, up and down, not understanding, addressing the root cause, the reason why I was having this yo yo effect. You know, so got on Plexus. I started starting this new me. I had to find Bertina all over again. <laughs> so the weight wasn't coming off fast enough. So I stayed consistent, drinking my water, trying the products. And then I started noticing non scale victims. I started getting the energy, my cholesterol lowered, y'all more than it has ever been in my life. I thought it was normal. I didn't know the difference between fat and inflammation. I mean, I just had some great wins. I just was feeling so good to where I had to just share it. Just tell the story and share it. And the better I felt, the more I shared. The more I shared, the more people joined. And the more people joined, the more I got paid. I had no idea that I was gonna be in Texas with this as my business. I didn't know I was gonna be in health and wellness. I retired because I wanted to be me. I wanted to be selfish for the first time ever in my life. But I tell you, it has truly been a blessing. And I will forever tell my story because, you know, I was a part of network marketing years ago. But the difference in this, seeing the lives being changed for people, is just rewarding. And to be a part of a company that shares the mission of changing lives and health and wellness is so rewarding. You know, so I'm so thankful right now. I'm a senior goal ambassador, and my goal is to become a diamond. That's my goal. I don't know when, but I'm going to tell it to the mountaintop. 
I will forever tell my story and tell the goodness of Christ. Couldn't find my mute button, sorry. <laughs> thank you, Bertina. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You brought us to church. You brought us to church. I loved it. Thank you. <laughs> All right, y'all. Say that again. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, y'all. Um, so next we will hear from, is it Nikki Swain? Yes, ma'am. Hey, okay. I don't have it in front of me, y'all, but I texted earlier, my bad. I'm trying to be all, you know, trying to be, uh, what do you call it, organized, and I, now I don't have it in front of me. But uh, all right, Nikki, take it away, Baba. Okay, so again, like Rhea said, my name is Nikki Swain, and I am a gold ambassador with Plexus. And prior to Plexus, I would say I am a fairly healthy person. I've always worked out. I've always been conscious of um, my health and the way I look because by trade I am a nurse however um, there was a point in my life where you know tragedy struck and I just didn't feel like myself I couldn't sleep I was just all over the place and it's still so new that I still get shaken when I talk about it but uh, I was introduced to Plexus. I just happened to see one of my friends from high school post about it, Janine Dabon. And I'm like, you know what? I've tried everything else. You know, I'm one of those people who will try it if it doesn't work, but I will at least try. You know, I've done Isogenics. I've done um, Avocare. You name it, I've tried it because that's just part of my world. I'm a fitness person. I like to work out. I like to try new things and just stay healthy. So during this time, it was more emotional, it had nothing to do with physical, and I could not outwork the feelings. I couldn't out, outwork the, the sleepless nights. Um, I don't care how much I worked out, it, my mind was still spinning. Um, gave Plexus a try, and literally it was just a try, and it turned out to be the best thing I could have ever done for myself. While I would have considered myself to be healthy and at a good size, the weight started coming off, which was unexpected and not something I was looking looking for, but a very pleasant um, outcome as well. Um, my sleep improved almost immediately, but you know, all, aside from all the physical um, and emotional gains, for me, I think the biggest thing has been the community. Now, the products work. I will shout that to the mountaintop, but the sisters that I've gained on this journey has been something that has been, um, I didn't know I needed it until I received it. So the community has helped me to grow personally. You would not catch me speaking on a call a couple years ago. That's just not who I am. However, I've grown to a place where I'm able to step into my journey into the goodness of who I am and share my story because it's important. I can be a testimony for someone else who may be an introvert and quiet and just shows that we are all able to grow from one another. That has been the biggest thing for me on this Plexus journey. Now, my, my physical benefits, my emotional benefits are there as well, but it's the community for me that has kept me steadfast and willing to share and continue to grow on this personal journey. So thank you for allowing me to share. And I look forward to being here forever. I'm a lifer. Yay. Thank you, Nikki. Yes. I love that. Plexus lifer. Yes. Yes. I love it. Um, we use that term a lot, y'all. It's for a reason. Um, you're not going to say you're a lifer or something you don't want to be doing or be around, right? And um, I love that part about community, Nikki. Um, can't, can't stress that enough. Can't express that enough too. Thank you, Nikki Swain. Appreciate you. All right. My sister from another Mr. Adrian Williams. Woo -woo. Hey, everybody. Thank you, Rhea, for giving me this opportunity. I'm so excited to be here with you guys. Happy to see everybody on this team thrilled to hear the stories of these beautiful ladies here and I mean I know they theirs are incredible it's many more like them and 
it just brings me so much hope to hear stories like this in time, in the times we live in, right? I, yes, I am a dentist um, by my day job. So I don't hear a lot of happy stories. <laughs> Unfortunately, you know, we have to record medical histories and, you know, I, I live kind of in a pressure pot a little bit in healthcare and especially since COVID, but I hear stories of people's health on the decline mostly, um, you know, and I try to do my part to help them out. So my, the mouth is connected to the rest of the body, but before Plexus, um, which was three years ago this month, wow, I was searching you know, always, always searching for something to feel better. Uh, the, I'd been practicing in my own practice for about seven years. So I'd added the layer of entrepreneurial, entrepreneurial and business onto uh, my plate of being a mom, you know, working full time, um, being a wife and just all around leading a busy life. So adding the business component uh, then at that time, really added another layer of stress to, to me. And I was really feeling that weight. Um, financially, I was feeling it because the business, you, they say it takes about seven years to really see, you know, the profits from a business. So our family was feeling it. Um, and myself personally, just really burn out and working a lot and not really seeing, um, not feeling like I was making a big impact. Um, just because of the nature of our business. It's not one that there are a lot of, so there's not a lot of like hoopla and, you know, great, a great uh, thanks and appreciation. You know, I was also too feeling very isolated because I'd been, I'd come from a place where I had, was around a team of, of women. And, um, but then I moved to my own practice. So I was very alone something that's common in healthcare and common in our industry and solo practitioners, we start to feel that isolation um, and just, they call it compassion fatigue. That is what I was starting to experience. I wasn't really happy a lot. It was just, I was feeling, I was starting to turn on my family and my friends and my relationships and myself because I was so burnt out from, from helping and pouring out to others. I hadn't really poured much into me. So I had started looking for, I started looking for something to help me sleep because I, knowing and understanding how important sleep is and this in your whole health, um, I needed to sleep. I was also starting to feel some aches and pains um, approaching 40, or I guess at that point I was past 40, but I'd started to have some aches and pains and which is common in my industry as well. Um, and just starting to feel very tired. So I was consuming lots of coffee throughout the day because I wasn't really sleeping well at night. I was very like wound up. And that was what um, I had heard of as considered like adrenal overdrive, right? Because my I was just pumping out a lot of the stress hormones were just, it was a lot. So I was wired and tired, right? At the same time. I don't know how that happens, but chugging coffee back to make it through the day and at night I was so wound up and I couldn't rest so I was like in this weird place I didn't I was like oh lord am I about to be taking like uppers and downers and um that's where I was you know I know these people that you know, go through these cycles but I was looking for a natural approach and my good friend Rhea um mentioned that Plexus had a CBD oil. I was looking for a CBD oil. I forgot that part uh, to help me sleep and to help with my joint pain. Well, she said Plexus. I said, okay, what's that? She said, there's some probiotics and this and that, which I had been on probiotics for a long time for my OB, OB gen. Um, I'd been going to Whole Foods. She didn't really give me recommendations. So I just been trying a bunch because I was having girly issues, didn't know really the cure. I knew that that would help, but I hadn't found like long, like, solid results with with what I've been taking so I thought why not let me try something else but when let me tell you I am one that is not unlike Nikki I have had not tried a lot of things other than what I you know saw on the shelf so if it came you know if it came from I was suspicious like I just suspect everything especially you know something that was unfamiliar and that's just all it was it just was unfamiliar but I trusted my friend I knew she wouldn't wouldn't be taking any junk like i knew that if she was taking it and giving it to her kids, then it was okay. I would be okay. I didn't, I hadn't been researching all that stuff I'd been taking from the store. And it's the same. It's absolutely the same. When you go down the vitamin aisle, 
you know, I found it is the not the same results, but you don't really know. You don't, you just see it. So you you get familiarized and a comfort there. But Plexus, hands down, is the best supplement, vitamin, probiotic I have ever tried. And I won't go into many details, but she gives me the pro the, the CBD oil too. So after I started taking the probiotic a couple of weeks, I was like uh, blown away. The probiotics, uh, I started with the triplex. So I had the probiotics, the pink drink, and um, the bioplan. So after it sat there a couple of days, then I decided I would give it a try. I was like, whoa, because y'all, I didn't, I didn't have time to feel worse, right? You already feel bad and you get into like this comfort of, well, I already know what I'm dealing with. I don't want to add anything on this to, you know, tip me over the edge to another problem, right? You don't. So I was like, I just don't want to feel any worse, but I just thought, what, why not? Give it a try. Your friend vouched for it. Why not? Yeah, I didn't have time to feel worse. So I'm like, um, I had my little regimen down, you know, my, I was just comfortable in discomfort and dis-ease. That is crazy. Now that I think about it, it's crazy. But that's where we get. That's the place we uh, we go when, when we are just, we don't have hope and we just lose hope on, you know, that anything can change. So um, when I started to feel better, I was like blown away. I got that CBD oil. And do you know, I might have, it maybe took me a year to finish it. And I would just take it just to see if I, you know, if it would make a difference, but I was sleeping better. I also had the Mega X, um, which helps with that. I was sleeping better. I was energized throughout the day. I wasn't, didn't need like multiple cups of coffee. I still drank coffee because I liked it. The time I wasn't doing the energy drink, the clean energy drink, but um, I just felt a hundred percent better. And along with Miss what Bertina was saying, the non-scale victories, um, the energy was there. Everything that I started, I just, just felt so why I started all of that came to me. And then some, I, I started to experience less congestion. I had chronic allergies and sinuses. All of that started to dissipate all of the, um, I had plantar fasciitis. I was a runner. I had hip pain, joint pain. All of that just started to dissipate and I hadn't really done anything, but, you know, start these supplements, anything new. So I was able to continue, you know, my life. And I felt like I was a better person all around and a better wife, dentist, you know, uh, business owner. And all of that has stayed the same. I just feel like I'm continuing to grow. And I feel like things that I want to do, I, I see more possibility in what's out there because Plexus gave me that. It gave me the, oh, things can change. It gave me that insight and that hope of possibility and just the world is about, you know, open to you if you just give things a try right? So that's the biggest thing in the community. So yeah, I'm having these, you know, being a part of this, like that loneliness, all those things I never imagined could come from something like this, never in a million years. So I just thank God for that. Um, yeah, I feel like, you know, God sneaks in the blessings, you know, in packages, because I, you know, I just, I'm one of those people that's so extra cautious and scared of stuff that I wouldn't, I don't know that I would have stepped out there, but thank God, you know, for Rhea and introducing me to this, to this. And I'm so happy to gotten to know you ladies and um, all this, these phenomenal people across this world at this point who have experienced the same that um, I'm not, you know, I don't feel lonely and isolated. I found my people. So I love that. Thank you. I'm sorry I talked so long. <laughs> no, you did. That was perfect. That was perfect. And I, I love when you said I found my people. You know, a lot of us, a lot of us feel that way. Um, I, 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 a majority of us feel that way. I feel that way. We found mm -hmm. our people. So thank you, Adrian, for sharing. And I, I, it's so funny, y'all. Out of all the stories that, um, you know, people have to share, right? And, and all the stories on our team, I would think that Adrian's is the one that I know best, right? Because we are so close. We were close before Plexus. I've known Adrian since freshman orientation at Xavier. And all y'all know that she's, you know, one of my closest, closest friends. 
And it's just so funny why, and this is why it's important for us to continue sharing our stories because I learned something today, you know, from Adrian. I learned something from everybody who shared today, but I had completely forgotten that what got Adrian started on Plexus was a product that they don't even sell. Like it's not even in the back, back office, right? It's not even, you can't even shop for it, okay? At the time it was a promotional, the CBD oil. It was a promo. And so you got a free CBD oil bottle um, with, I think it was 150 PV subscription, not with a welcome pack, right? It had to be your subscription order. So when Adrian got started, she got started on a one ninety nine welcome pack. I was like, girl, I will give you some CBD. You about to spend two hundred dollars on this on, your, on, on Plexus? I will give you a bottle of my CBD that I get for free. So I, I, I and I remember I was like, okay. I, and I asked her. I said, there's a isolate and a full spectrum. It's two different kinds. And so for my next subscription, I made sure I had one hundred and fifty, and because I knew I was going to give that free CBD oil to Adrian, right? And I'm just, I'm sharing this part and really stressing this part, y'all, because you don't know what will get people started on Plexus. Now, I knew that she was going to love the supplements, you know, because I, I know what the supplements are going to do and I knew what they would do for her family. But just keep that in mind when Plexus has, has different promotionals, uh, when they have what they call the gateway, a gateway product, you know, um, that kind of, that will introduce people to Plexus. Just keep in mind Adrian's story because we all know Adrian joining this team and Adrian deciding to become a business builder is what catapulted Team Grit. Okay, like that is the the fire, the energy for Team Grit is Adrian's team and she took off. Right. So just remember that. Where would we be right now had I not mentioned to Adrian CBD? And I just kind of thought, oh, well, that's not even something that Plexus even offers. You can't even buy that on their website. So maybe she should try something else or whatever, you know, not even talking to her. So just remember that, y'all, that it doesn't have to be somebody approaching you saying, I need to get my gut health straight. I want to buy, I want to start with Triplex, right? So, I mean, we have to let people know everything that's out there and that's available and don't discount any of that. And I have to also mention everyone that shared tonight, these are, you know, y'all, all of these people had full plates, right? Had uh, come off of full um, careers and were looking to just, you know, chill like Bettina, right? Or Nikki, you know, who is, I mean, Nikki does not give herself enough credit and talk about her background and what she does in her education and like, a nurse, right? It, um, it does not talk about that enough. Um, and I, I'm not even, I know I'm not even doing her justice, right? I know I'm not even saying it right. But, um, and then you have, you know, Adrian, a dentist owns her own practice. So had, you know, Janine thought to herself, well, you know, I'm, I'm not even gonna approach Nikki. She has a lot on her plate. Or had Tiffany not, you know, wanted to approach Bertina. Or if I had said, I, you know, uh, Adrian's not gonna be interested in the business side of this. You know, she has so much on her plate. She is a dentist. She's, you know, owns her own practice. If any of, of us had had that mindset, then these people would not be right here right now sharing this story about community, about health, about this tribe. So keep that in mind too. Um, it's not about us when we share our story. It's about the people who are gonna hear the story and, and where, how it's gonna change their lives. So thank y'all ladies so much, so much for sharing tonight. I appreciate y'all. I think this is like a record call, time call, but I'm kind of proud of us, right? Because, you know, we like to talk. So thank y'all so much for sharing. Um, I am going to post it hopefully tonight. Um, if it pop, I'm going to let it convert and, um, and then pop back on here and, and post it tonight because this was a really, really good one. So thank y'all so much for joining. Next Monday, I believe it's Monday, we have our, yeah, next Monday, the 22nd is our vision casting call, y'all. Seven days from today, we have a vision casting call. So be looking for that graphic and that is for both ambassadors and prospects. So it's for everyone and we will be um, casting vision for both ambassadors and prospects who are thinking about starting Plexus. Okay, so please, please, please hop on to that. We will um, share about uh, the health side and the business side, and then we will let other people just pop in and share. Um, it's gonna be a very organic call that always just, I love these calls, so I'm excited about it. That's on the 22nd on Monday, okay? All right, y'all, thank y'all for joining. I love y'all. Everyone have a wonderful Monday. Bertina, Nikki, Adrian, thank y'all for sharing tonight. Bye, y'all.